Oh, we're live. There we go. Some music theory philosophy. Let's drop it. Sierra Cis Cisneros. Oh, I almost messed that up. Boy, that was really bad. We'll edit that in post. Cisneros. Yes, I love it. There we go. Let's let that vibe for a sec. Oh, listen. Oh, I'm just singing that. I don't know. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever feel weird listening to your own music? Oh, Kimi, I kind of hate listening no. to my own music. You yeah, sound yeah. so good. Oh, okay. There we go. My mom, like, was like, maybe speak to I said this every episode. My mom's like, you should play their music. <laughs> my mom's amazing. Love her. Love you, Karen. <laughs> Karen. I'm going to feel it. Like you have some. Ooh. Wow. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. I <laughs> see you. Hey. 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 How you doing, Randy? Good to Randy? see you guys today. Thank you for being on the show. Well, thanks for having me, Dave. Well, we've been good friends now for a while, and it's, it, it's crazy that it took me this long to get... To, I, that's on me. No, it's No, okay. it isn't. It's, it's just, okay. it was waiting for the right time. We were waiting time. for the right yes. time. I love it. Thank you so much for being so positive. About it. <laughs> uh, you know, it's really cool, actually, to see how many people are in the community and just being able to get and meet so many new people. Yeah. It's so much fun. It really and then, is. And then you come back and you're looking, I have this long list of people. I'm like, this person needs to be on the show. show. This person, this person. And this person. And then I'm like, oh, wait, Sierra's on. I haven't got Sierra yet. Um, so that's good. It's great. So I really appreciate it. And this is, this is going to be a great episode. I can tell you what. I'll tell you what. What? I will tell you what. What? what? There we go. Okay. So. One, uh, one thing I love about Sierra, if you don't know, Sierra is one of the most multi-talented people I've ever met in my oh, life. You just, you cover this board <laughs> of, of talent and it umbrellas out to so many different things. I know a lot of like really talented musicians and you're one of those talented musicians. Oh, I know thank a lot of you. just talented, creative artists and you are one of those artists as well. And I feel like there's nothing that you can't do. Is there something you can't do? I can't do? dance. You I can't dance? I don't mm -hmm. believe you at This all. is the extent of my dancing. This and if I go hard, I'm like, yeah. But other than that, uh, not better. so much. Got it. It's better. It's better. I'm a terrible dancer as well. I don't know. You do. I mean, your name's Crazy Legs. Yeah, so but like, that's more yeah. like, <laughs> yeah, I need to get better at that. I, it, it, I feel like it, it doesn't match up well. I time. think I think it matches up well. well. Thank, you. <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, yeah, but Echo's always like, man, we gotta, we gotta learn how to move a little bit more. Yeah, My yeah. white guy dance moves are not crazy. <laughs> hey, I mean, if you're just vibing, I think If people, you vibe, then you're fine. Yeah, I mean, people feel the vibe, so yeah. it's just as long as you're going. That's the, I think the trick with dance is to not think about what, if, and, and the funny thing is if you if you go, to, if you, you're at a club and you're dancing, I was going to say, and, and dance, which is so funny because it's been such a long time. Um, then if you look around at everybody else, they're terrible. You know what I mean? <laughs> See? Oh, you're like, it's, oh, it's... wow. <laughs> Everybody's bad. I, so I'm the guy that when you're at a dance, you're like, man, I hope nobody's watching. I'm usually the person like, oh, that guy's terrible. <laughs> but if they watch yeah. me, they'd be like, wow, that guy's really bad. <laughs> well, I think it's probably like a mutual understanding. It's like, we're all not good. Mm -hmm. and that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> we're here <laughs> for, to, for the vibe. That's okay. <laughs> yes, that's very true. It's very true. It depends on all, who you're around. True. As well, sometimes. That's true. Like Echo, he's a really good dancer. So yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so then you're like, oh, I I'm really see. Yeah. <laughs> sometimes you'll be like, yeah, you did pretty good today. And I'll be like, oh, that's, that's, good. Nice. that's like an extra oh for me. Yeah, yeah. I know that means a lot because she lied. So that's <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, let's see. So I wanted to ask, is that all that creativity, is that a connection for you? Like when you're, when you're, uh, drawing something or trading something or, or songwriting or, or writing a part, is, is that all connected for you? Or do you feel like it's just this one piece of you that you're able to tap into or do you have to go to different places to make that work? It probably just kind of depends on what I'm working on. So I would say that, I don't know, fundamentally I am a musician. So like, so say for like my, my album or my EP, um, when I, I wrote the music for that, 
then I kind of tapped into it and really kind of thought of what all that music meant to me. Mm -hmm. And then from there, I got the inspiration for the art, That's you know? Great. So I, I have the ability to, to kind of listen to something music wise and then kind of translate it into mm -hmm. an art piece. Yeah. But then at the same time, sometimes I, ju I just write music for music and I just write art for art. So yeah. it just it just depends on what, what it's for. But okay. I think in general, I kind of move through the world as just a creative person. A so creative with person. music and then art and everything. That's yeah. incredible. <laughs> uh, what are some ways that you feel like you naturally... Uh, sorry, there are so many lights. And I'm like, <laughs> like, my is I know I own all these lights. I wish you could see. There's a lot of lights. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six different colors going. I'm coming out of the room. Yeah, six of them. I'm coming out of the room. Is he, is he on drugs? No, no. You just pop a couple of ambient? No, I'm just, it's just that bright. I, I look like I just stepped out of a tan and like, just uh, coming out of it. Okay, sorry. Uh, what was I, I'm, see, This is half the, as I don't define worry, don't behind worry. the scenes, you're like, oh, he's got it. No, I don't. Most of the, the episodes are just me. That's just go with the lights. What's going on? Um, Oh crap, I had it. see this is why I write down all this stuff too. That's good, it's okay. Oh no, is there a way that you keep in the zone with creativity? Is there a way that I keep in, probably just really like listening to music that I like or okay. anything. It doesn't even, have, I don't even have to like it. No. You know, I, I was explaining this to my friend the other day. I feel like with all the music and genuine music, not stuff that's manufactured for like the you know, people, mm -hmm. but like one that's just genuinely from the artist, there's always something that you can pick out of songs that are just like genius, yeah, you know, yeah. that are just like, you could tell that that person really cared yeah. about it, you know, and kind of same thing with art. Art's a little bit different in, in design because I don't know, I feel like it's a different medium, you mm -hmm. know, but I, I would say just kind of really looking at things and kind of find inspiration on, on art or, or even through music is kind Very of how cool. I stay in it, yeah. What are some groups that you like uh, listening to? Paris, PV, it's PVRIS. They just came out with a new album and it Ooh. killed, well, no, they're coming out with a new album. They okay. came out with a new song and like a new EP a little bit while back, but it was really, okay. really good. So I've been listening to them on repeat. I dig it. Yeah, yeah. We'll yeah. put that in, sorry, Instagram, we'll put that one on the, in the, uh, and the link in the bio. Yeah, the bio. yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. my God, I, it's, it's so good. The description. Got the description. It. There you go. It's P A P V R I S. P V. So it's like Paris, but the V's like the oh, A split. P, P V R I S. P yes, yeah. Gotcha. So it's like Paris. Edgy Paris. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Paris. Yeah, yeah. So like, if somebody had like dyslexia and tried to spell it, right? Should that be? Let's see. You know, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> 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 Nothing like that. What kind of genre do they play? Um, it's kind of hard to explain. I don't like genres. I should, as soon as I ask that question, I wish I could like, just put it right back in my mouth. It's okay. I mean, we all kind of have to like, I don't know, it's simplify it, but it's, I would say they're alternative. alternative. But like their That's new stuff, broad well, it's yeah. broad. That's why yeah. I like their alternative. It's great. It's great. Um, kind of edge on the poppy vibe, but okay. they're a little bit more edgy than pop. So, so cool. that's why it's like alternative. I don't know. I love them. So I love cool. them. I don't know why. I just vibe with them. That's so, so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Have you heard, uh, man, I just started listening to a band called Black Honey. Black Honey. Have you heard them before? Uh, I've not. It sounds it sound pretty cool, good. though. It's kind of, I would say, just from what you said, it sounds kind of same. Same. But, but once again, all, it's such a broad. Alternative. <laughs> who, who, knows, who knows what that means? Yeah. Well, you know, I've also been listening to uh, St. Paul and the Broken Hearts. Have you heard that? Well, they sound good. They sound good. like they're deep. very soul. What yeah. do they call it? Uh, blue eyed soul kind of stuff. Blue eyed soul. Yeah, when white people try to sing. Like, oh, you know? oh, yeah. It has a cool effect. Yeah, somebody <laughs> told me that the other day. Uh, it was one of my guitar students, uh, mom, Nicole Homer. Oh. Yeah, so, John and, and Brooke Homer. Yes, oh, incredible very cool. family. Very Such cool. a good family. They said blue eyes. Well. I was like, oh, that's oh. awesome. <laughs> I loved it. That's when I like when you break out of the genre, the box. Oh, so yeah. So every time, like if someone's like, oh, I'm indie art, oh, you're like, ah. Oh, it's, it's, yeah. it's like saying I play music. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what that means. Was, yeah. it's, <laughs> it's so funny. Okay, uh, let's go over this. So we're, we're talking about songwriting. Man, I, um, what is, you just released an EP 
recently. Yes. And you went through Eric Marina for that one. Yes. Right? That's yes. awesome. My heart, your heart pumped onto my, not my heart pumped onto you. It's the same message though. Same message. No, man. It's a good one. Such a great host. I miss it all the way. Um, so, uh, what's, what's one of you, as time has progressed, what's, what do you feel like, man, I really, this song has just grown on me some more? Out of, out of the EP? Out of the EP, yeah. <sighs> Probably Frankie's song. Yes! I would say. Just because, well, the thing is, I wrote it, and I wasn't even sure to really put it on the EP, because yeah. I wrote it just as a stupid little song that, nice that song. just to, I don't know, it was just what I was feeling at the time, and I was just feeling grateful for my little five-pound chihuahua. <laughs> I was like, you know, here here we go, and after kind of seeing people's response to it, they seemed to kind of like that 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 vibe and just how it's so happy. And yes. so I'm like, you know, it is kind of a fun little heart life, it is lighthearted so song. Fun. So I was like, so you fun. know, I like that one. But. We'll put a we'll put a little picture of the of Frankie. A baby. I the baby. You, my baby Frankie. <laughs> I didn't know until today. I think you know, I've, I've been to your conscious before and you talked about Frankie being the dog, but I don't know He's why. The dog. Yeah, you gotta it get did the not visual. click until you posted the picture today. I, and I was like, what's Frankie looking at? <laughs> the, I know what Frankie is. <laughs> That's so cool. That's so much fun. Uh, there's one, which see, oh my gosh, I'm such a bad host. Don't worry about no, it. No, I got it right here. We got one, it. Luna. That oh, one is, is Luna. I, when it came out, that one, I was like, this one is see? my jam. I love this song. Wow. That, see, that that means a lot because, again, I guess it's just of the person. Like, I don't know. I'm always like, I don't know about my songs. You know? No. So, it's so good. It's such a good song. Oh, like thank you. But Luna it, it, oh. and, uh, one, was one that I was a little bit, like, sketchy again to put on the EP. Well, I was going to definitely put on the EP. But yeah. it's one that I'm just sketchy with just because it's kind of more artsy okay. you know it doesn't really follow like your heart comes blood to mine is pretty pop it's like yeah. here we go here's what you have perfectly placed on that yeah thing. but yeah. like luna goes into this weird i like to call it like spacey funk like little solo thing that's yeah. like kind of weird it does. in the it middle vibes out. yeah it yes. vibes out so i'm like i don't know how people are gonna respond so it, it. it means a lot <laughs> that is such a good song i it's love that song i think we put that one do i put that one on the I have a music theory philosophy playlist. Uh, we'll put a link in that okay. as well. Uh, so, and it's all the guests that have been on the show. And oh, I'm cool. Pretty sure I put Luna. Luna on there. I might have put, uh, I can't remember. It's one of those two. I am the worst host of all time. <laughs> you do that. I've never get, double guessed myself so, <laughs> so much in my entire life. That's, that's a lie, but that's okay. That's a lie. <laughs> that's a lie. That's a lie. Okay, so we were talking earlier, and this is the way that the, tr the, the process works. Um, about ways that we stay in the zone mm -hmm. with this. Is there a way that you are pitfalls or that you fo stay away from to get out of like a creative place? You're like, man, I know, I know for me, mm -hmm. I'll say this, Go ahead. if I'm watching a lot of TV, <laughs> if, I, if I've noticed I've watched most of Rick and Morty <laughs> in the past few days, I'm not gonna be creative. creative. I can't do it. Yeah. 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 I gotta I gotta read. Reading helps me a lot. Right. Um, oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean that makes sense though, because I guess the every, that's another form of creativity. So yeah. that kind of kind of sinks in your little Gets it brain. Going. Yeah, yeah, for sure. yeah, for sure. With me, I there's not really necessarily a way to like stay out of it, yes. but I've noticed a pitfall for my creativity is when I've been going hard at school, okay. especially when finals start coming around. I start to burn myself out yes. with, with all the final projects, you know? And so I find I'll, I'll want to write. I'm like so excited to write and to get creative and I just feel the creative juices flowing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when I go into break, then I just, I, I can't write anything worthwhile. And yeah. usually it takes me a couple weeks to, just get, back to get back into it. And it kills me a little bit because I, 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 that's what I'm looking forward yeah, to. Yeah. That's what's keeping me going, go. you Let's know? Go. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, you know, again, I guess what I, I try to do um, is usually I'll try to dedicate at least, uh, I would say even 10 minutes to an hour worth of just working on guitar at the at the end of the day Man, just to great. kind of even if I'm not if I'm playing like crap and I'm tired yeah. but it, it 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 helps kind of alleviate that a little bit that's so you great know, so. I love it I wish all my students would do the exact <laughs> same thing I've been a big uh I'm always talking about like 50, uh, the 15 minute day yeah uh, thing where like everybody thinks like oh I can't I don't have enough time to go on a to work out yeah, or to, do, yeah. to read or to do circle work or whatever a project or play guitar right or songwriting right 
there's a lot of things I just listed. Uh, but the way that you can do it, just if you, you do have 15 minutes a day, everybody's got that. So the way that you do it, 10 minutes is so good. Yeah, even if it's just 10, like usually those days are a little, I'm like dead. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I just want to pick you up my guitar. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 10 minutes will do me in, you know? Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, yeah, it, it, it helps. It's so sure. good and it keeps it flowing. It's so much better than going like a, oh, you're getting a lot of love right now. Aaron. Hey, Aaron. Let's go. Oh, you stop it, Aaron. Aaron's too sweet. She said, dang, my phone is exploding from so much talent on the screen. What are you talking about? And so much love. Long time for another show. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta love Aaron. Yeah. Hope you're feeling good today. Yeah. Yeah. I know that doesn't make... When you say stuff like that, especially on the, the, the YouTube, the it's YouTube. like what time... Like, it doesn't matter. It could be like 2 p.m. and you're watching this. Or it could be 3 a.m. and they're watching this. It's true. Who knows? Maybe they just needed that, though. Maybe they just needed they that. They just needed, hope you're feeling good today. Hope you're feeling good today. So, we yeah, love you. There you yeah. go. There you go. Um, oh, oh, I was going to say, yes. If you, the, the longer that you put, like a 10 minute, 10, 10 minutes a day is so much better than like two, hour, two hours once a week. week. True. Yeah. Yeah. It it, it's just the consistent thing. You stay sharp. Consistency. You're keeping the juices flowing. That's a great mm -hmm. way, to, like you said, not, not touching as a, as a sure Surefire. Oh, we yeah. talked about that. Oh, yeah. Weird, weird board. Surefire. Sure weird, weird. I like it though. It's well, kind of fun. I'll, I'll say it again. One more sure time. Fire. Surefire. Today's episode brought to you by Surefire. Surefire. Sure sure when you're thinking something is sure and you need a fire, Surefire. Sure surefire. Sure sure <laughs> All right. Let's go over the next. Uh, let's see. What you got? Let's see. Uh, where do you draw most of your infor inspira inspira inspiration? Inspiration. Inspiration or inspiration, depending on what part of the country you're from. Where do you draw most of that from? Is there like a weird, we kind of talked about this a little bit, but is there a weird, a weird way outside of music in general? Or is it just like listening to, to songs that you find most of that? Probably, and again, I feel like each kind of piece that I create, music or art, mm -hmm. it, it depends on what, what the vibes are and what I'm going for. But yes. I really just like Instagram, I like to look at what art people have made or yes. even like just the guitar gods that are on Instagram, yeah. you know, the people I'm talking about. There's that or are trying to find like new music, um, just listening to stuff that I wouldn't listen to before, okay. you know, and, and sometimes even listening to like, like older stuff. Like I love Dolly Parton. Yes. I love Dolly Parton. You gotta love Dolly. So uh, when I first kind of discovered my love from her, yes. it, it inspired me to, to kind of think in a different way. And more specifically, it inspired me to think in songwriting. That's so cool. Way. Just because, you know, Dolly, she, you know, she's definitely one of the lead, like, women performers, I would say. You know, mm -hmm. everybody knows Dolly freaking Parton. Everybody you know? knows Dolly, Dolly freaking Parton. Dolly, Dolly, oxen free Parton. <laughs> There you go. You know? So, and I'll, I started thinking about it, and I'm like, well, really, she's just a BA songwriter. She's able yeah. to, to yeah. yeah, she is. Thank you for saving that. BA. BA songwriter. <laughs> you know? Because she, she's able to tell these stories oh, in yeah. such a unique way. She is. And so, I don't know. So, just, just kind of going outside the box and trying to look. At, at things at a different angle, looking at music and different music and art and different art yes. and seeing the different Maybe aesthetics. even something you're like, man, I didn't know. I remember exactly. when I was growing up, uh, somebody was like, it was right around the time Demi Lovato was doing stuff. Weird, <laughs> weird that I'm going off on this Demi right now. Demi Lovato. And somebody said, oh, you got to check out the song. I was like, dude, it's Demi Lovato. I'm like, check it out. It's Demi but Lovato. on this, dude, I was like, this song is a banger. <laughs> this song is so good. And then it made me realize like, Oh, they're like some Justin Bieber songs. I'm like, this is a great song. song? Yeah, you can, yeah, I can't hate on this song. Yeah, yeah. And it's not good to just be like, oh, I don't like that artist oh, because he, they fit in this box. Right, Or right. like, they're older or newer right. or too new or mm -hmm, whatever they're doing. Mm -hmm. there's, there's just good music in every genre. It's true. Do you have a favorite Dolly song? Do I have a favorite Dolly? I really like uh, Code of Many Colors. Code it was one of like her first... The top of my head. I, 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 even, I even covered it. I just, the, the, it was, I think it came off of her first album, I want to say, mm -hmm. um, but it's just, the story that she tells through it is just like, it's like a, a heart teaser, okay. and I don't know, it's just a so lot of great. genuineness Just to a it. great song. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, did, you, did you just play that at the uh, Sozo? Was yeah. that, is that the Sozo 10 year anniversary? That's what it was. Yes! yes, yes I yes, did yes, hear yes. that song. Yes. You did the first one that I heard. I was like, man, this song is so good. good. <laughs> I, I haven't heard that before. Yeah, yeah. It's so cool. It's a really neat song. I mean, I know like sure. 9 to 5 and Jolene. I'm uh, very service level. Like 9 to 5. 
<laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, man. <laughs> Showing up at my dad's yeah. eating skills. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah. Elbows, that's, that's a new one. technique. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is. <laughs> uh, let's say, let's say, top five favorite artists from across the board since we're on Dolly Parton. Sure. That actually, that was a great segue. I shouldn't point it out when I do that. It just happened that's to work. That, that's, uh, that's a great favorite, segue. Favorite so top five artists, let's say it could be anything. So not just, let's, let's Oh. So just from, not Ooh. just a musician. That's rough. And we can say we can change it tomorrow so we don't put too much pressure okay, on it. Okay, okay. So, top five, Paris. Paris. John wow. Mayer. John Mayer, there we go. Uh... Look at John Mayer song. We got the oh John Mayer. Oh my God, I love pitch. John Mayer. God, how do you pick one? Mm. I freaking love, There's a, just in general, the album Search for Everything. So good. That's like it's, my it's favorite. It's a newer one, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The one, uh, have you heard Split Screen Sadness off Heavier Things? Yes. That one's always hit me, and Wheel, the older I get, uh, really gets me too. Yeah, Wheel's um, intense. I believe the, the love I, what is I believe the love I, I don't remember. I, I totally bombed right there. I'll put it up on the lyrics, and yeah. it'll be like, you suck, Dean. <laughs> and it says the lyrics right there. <laughs> I don't know the melody. I'm it. Sorry, let's keep going. So we got John Mayer. Paris. Paris or Paris? Uh, Paris. <laughs> no, I used to could pronounce it. I'm glad I good Paris. Uh, God, I'm trying to think of like artists, like artists, artists. Yeah, okay, but still the musician. Uh, Yvette Young, she's a guitarist for Covet. Okay. Uh, I find her really inspiring. Love it. Um, there's this one photographer that I follow. I forget his name. He's on Instagram. Maybe we could put that on a. a on uh, good old YouTube, but uh, oh hi Eric, but um, he he does some really neat things with photography okay. that are, are outside of the box. I'd Love say it. He's, a, he's pretty pretty up there. We'll put it yeah we'll put it up in the in the, in the in box. The, yeah second. yeah. Uh, so we got one more artist that inspires you across the board. Across the board. Maybe an author or a painter. That's what I'm trying to think poet. of. Poet. Artist artist. You know, mm, an artist, artist. Oh, no, artist, artist. <laughs> I guess they're all, everybody's an artist, artist. Yes, I love it. <sighs> you know what? I'll just say I'm a musician. A heart. Heart. I'll say heart because heart. Heart's so good. I love heart. The I older heart. I get to, that's another one where I'm like, oh man, they I got this movie because really yeah. you know Barracuda. Yeah, oh just yeah. Just stopping such a Cuda. It's yeah, a Barracuda. Barracuda. <laughs> um, and what's the other one that they're really big for? Uh, there's Magic Man. Magic Man. I don't um, know. And Do then. Try. Mm -hmm. and, ooh, yes, yes, that's a good one. You have such a great, unique st voice. I love your voice oh, so much. Oh, thank you. Do you feel like you take something from from heart? heart. Like, so who do you feel like inspires you to? Um, I would say, like, especially Hart, because they, I, I, my old uh, vocal teacher, her name was Jen Durkin. Jen, much love. Oh, long God, I love show. Jen Durkin. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, well, she... Kenny. I, I, <laughs> who is it? That's Kenny. That's Echo's dad. Oh, Kenny? Long time friend of the show. Oh, hi, Kenny. Long time friend of the show. <laughs> great musician. Oh, great yeah? Musician. He Ooh. is, yeah. Great song That's exciting. You should uh, have sorry. him on the show. I should have him on the show. We're gonna, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you were saying uh, with uh, vocal coach. Yes. She, you know, with vocals, I, I've always sang my whole life, but mm -hmm. I didn't really get into it until seventh grade when okay. I sprained my ankle twice with oh. basketball. Oh. Twice in a row. Gosh. It ruined Disneyland for me. This is a long story, but yeah. I promise you. No, 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 no. We're going to get there. We've got more time. So then I had a couple of vocal teachers my mom, my parents put me in, um, you know, music lessons and stuff. So Jen and me just really vibed and mm -hmm. she showed me heart yeah. and it was, it was nice to see just like two BA, you know, females with Nancy and Ann Wilson because yes. Ann's a powerhouse singer yes. and then Nancy's a killer on the guitar. Mm -hmm. So I was like, well, you know, if they can do something like that, then I can do something yes. like that, you know, because... It was just really inspiring to I me. Love so, it. so I would say I do draw inspiration from her, especially with her belting. But yes. now, she's got such a powerful voice. oh gosh, she's she's crazy. Yes. She's crazy. And the guitar playing too. And, yeah. and it's something that was not, I feel like, adequately represented, especially in mainstream. Oh yeah. With oh yeah. Guitars. But you go, man, that girl can shred. Shred, yep, yes, she can. can shred. Yes, she can. Yep. And you can shred too if you uh. haven't seen <laughs> her play live. You gotta go oh see her play live. Oh my gosh. Yes, you play with dragons in the desert. I do. That's and my then man. You play uh, solo stuff a lot as well. Yes, yes. Nice. Yes, so, yes, okay, yes. I didn't want to cut. I'm no, just you're plugging good. your Don't worry, I appreciate, I appreciate the plug. Good, good, good. Okay. Um, so uh, maybe some other, who, who's somebody else that you. That, that, that I draw inspiration. Yeah, from, uh, from vocally. 
For vocally, you know, especially with the rock stuff, because I've been into the rock stuff lately. Yes. Um, there's Highly Suspect and Royal Blood. Oh, Highly Suspect is so good. I love them. I love uh, them. Uh, Brie, Brie Raymond. Show. Oh, yes. She's so good. Uh, yes. Love Brie. Love Long time for the show. Yes, yes, yes. Long time for the show. We need to have her on the show. There's so many people have her on the show. show. I should do it every day. You really Last should. Day. It it's would be okay. exhausting. It's okay. It's okay. Just leave That's the lights set up. Just leave it all set up. Just have people walk in the door. You know, before we end, I'm just going to show everybody. You got to show everybody the lights. You're like, what is going on? <laughs> One time I had, I think when I had Everett Malloy on the show, I had these lights set up. It wasn't like exactly like this. Um, and my mom was like, oh, they, you had such a good, it just good. seemed like such good light in that yeah, show. So, you're like, oh, like, oh okay, that's thanks, that's good mom. to know. <laughs> long time for the show, my mom. Long time for the show. Ever since you were born. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Longest time, friend of the show. I've got nothing but love <laughs> for that woman. She's amazing. I think I cut you off again. Highly suspect. And what was the other band you said? Oh, Royal Blood. They're kind of. Okay, I know of them. They're good. They're okay, really good. I, check them out. I take. I try to, like, as far as how I, especially with the band, yes. um, how I kind of put together my melodic lines, okay. um, I try to kind of draw inspiration from them just because yeah. I really like the way that Do you find m- together. melodic lines pretty easy for you to gravitate towards? I'm, I'll say this, I feel pretty good with, I, I, I'm not trying to break, with songwriting, I'm like, I love the process. process. Oh, me too. I really like finding melody with guitars and stuff mm-hmm. like that. I've always mm-hmm. been, feel like I'm pretty good at yeah, that. that yeah. But then vocal melody, it's the hardest thing oh, in the world for me. Oh, vocal melody, really? Do you feel like it's pretty easy for you? I, you know, and I, in general. But yeah. the thing is, uh, especially as I, I kind of grow as a musician, I get pickier and pickier of what I want for okay. the melody. So like, I can I can have like multiple ideas running, mm-hmm. but it, it I like if I want something catchy, I want something catchy, and it, it, yeah. it takes me a couple times to yeah, put yeah. it together and, and really get what I want. But um, with melody, I would say it's it's. Vocals in general are mm-hmm. just kind of like my, my back. Yes. Like, I've got this. You, I know, you know, you know, guitar, I, I always feel like, oh my, oh my God. <laughs> yeah. That's so funny because you're, so, you're such a great guitarist. Oh, well, thank, I, thank you. You, find, <laughs> you do a really great job of, of like, you're also very flashy, but you're also like just like in this park here, and you're like, oh man, that's exactly what I want to hear with that little bit of sprinkle of like, I didn't know that I wanted to hear that, and I needed it so bad. Which, as a guitarist, and I'm sure anybody watching is a guitarist, it totally gets like, it's like really hard to find that, that vibe. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. tough to find that vibe. I need to meet her. Kenny needs to meet you. We got to get Kenny, you and Kenny. Let's, we got to get you and Kenny get. together. We're going to make it okay. happen. What are you, you doing right now? You got it. What are you doing? Come on over. Come on over. <laughs> We're going to be running the show all day. <laughs> I'm going to meet everybody in the show. 24 hour special. Oh, 11 so to so 11. Oh, oh the, the last episode. <laughs> He's just asleep and somebody else is running it. We need that. We need that going through. Oh, okay. God. Um, let's see. Actually, that was the next one. Oh, man. We were going so much. So much into where I want to leave. Great um, segue. Where do you think? Yeah, great segue. <laughs> That's not right. Wait a oh, second. Okay. I, I do oh, like okay. crank it. I don't oh, know. No. I've ridden motorcycles. Oh, that was sweet. just a way for me to plug that on. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay. <laughs> uh, actually, when you're driving a motorcycle, you see someone on a Segway. So there's the motorcycle way you put your, your hand down. Oh, right, right, right. But when you get it and you do it and you're like, oh, there's another motorcycle. And you do that, right? Uh-huh. If you don't know, I just, oh, they're gonna come for me now. I might have to edit that out. What do you mean? The, you do motorcycles and we're not supposed to talk about this. Oh, really? <laughs> so anyways, when you're, you're driving and you, you put your hand up like that, and it's a, it's a Segway, not a Segway. <laughs> what are you saying? A moped, a moped, when it's a moped, not a Segway. When it's a moped and they're driving past, and you put your hand up, you feel like you've just been betrayed. And you kind of want to turn around and beat the crap out of that person. I'm not a violent person, but I want to do that. I want to do that. Yes. Oh, Kenny's recording today, 12 string. Ooh. 12 string at hand. Have Ooh. you played 12 string before? I, I've always wanted a 12 string. Nice. I love 12 string. I think they're really they're cool. They're so cool. They're really cool. Uh, you know, Matt Merchant. Oh, really cool. Matt Merchant kills so me good. with his 12 string. He's so I good. <laughs> After this, I'm actually going to a practice with him. Wow, what show. do y'all do? Oh. Release show on the 20th at Sozo. There's at a Sozo Coffee House. Sozo there you Coffee. Go. Love Sozo mm-hmm. Coffee. Mm-hmm. So, and I would say this, Lori loves a lot of people, but Lori doesn't talk about anybody as much as she talks. She loves oh. so much. She's just, and, and we gush over you all the time. My love, Lori. She is incredible. Long <laughs> time for the show. Long time for the show. show. <laughs> um, you have such a cool way of approaching the guitar. 
What is what is what are some uh, if you're giving tech uh, technique tips or just stylistic tips to anybody learning guitar? How would, I don't you, feel like I should give. No, you should. You should. <laughs> well, let, let me go over this. Let's, okay, let's okay, ask okay, it this way. Okay. This okay. makes you feel a little bit more comfortable. Um, what when you st How did you learn to play? Did you did you take lessons specifically? I mean, I did start with lessons, okay. but I think. The main thing that I rely on for my music, which I mean, it has a, it's it's like good things and it's bad things are my my ear. Okay. Um, and that's how I kind of approach guitar a lot okay. is with like I can hear the melody in my head and I'll play. And then you go through it. Yeah, to okay. yeah. But that's that's specifically with songwriting. Okay. But like with improvising and stuff. I mean, good old pentatonic scale. You go. Gotta love it. So you learned the pentatonic scale and and you kind of keep in that box and everything. I you see that's the thing because like. When I, I try, I try in general, I guess here's like my, my thing, right? Please. Don't be afraid to kind of break outside the box, okay. you know? So like I learned the pentatonic scale and then ever since I learned it, I try, I'm trying to find ways to incorporate different things yeah. into the improv, like, yes. you know, harmonics and yes. like just all kinds of weird things it. that sound good, oh, you know? You yeah, know? yeah. You find like, oh, this is it. We got another, uh, yeah. there's a. Uh, I guess that would be in there. Like, uh, there's an actual uh, seventh that, as opposed to the flat seventh or right. a regular third. And the so then you're adding different things. If you can teach somebody the pentatonic scale, though, it's, I feel like people are able to grasp yeah. um, the concept of like, oh, now I can play this here we scale go. Yeah, yeah. And, and the thing is, the good thing about the pentatonic scale, probably why it's like so popular, right? Yes. Um, is that you can play it over anything. So I think as a guitarist, Especially somebody that's just starting and I'm even just even now that I'm like somewhat mediocre mm -hmm. it It's something that it's like, okay, it sounds good. So I don't have to feel discouraged yeah. <laughs> You know, you yeah. know, so like here I am trying to practice this hard like polyphia song or whatever, yeah. Yeah, you know? yes. And then I'm like I suck at guitar So yeah, but just being a uh, and especially with like songwriting, not being afraid to try different things, yes. you know, yeah. and just even just stretch your hands, see what the crap comes out, you know? Yeah. you know, you <laughs> know. The pinky to me, the pinky has been one of the biggest game changers in songwriting. You're like, oh my gosh, that has like a different sound. <laughs> sound yes, yeah. And because I could just stretch my pinky out a little bit further. I have I to show like, you. Oh you, yeah. Have you used the thumb? I learned. I just oh, learned this on the br the back side of it. Not just the back. Oh, no, you you pulled up to the front. Oh my gosh. It's no so way. weird. I'll, I'll have you to show you. have to show me that. I'll have to show you. Oh my gosh. Do you have a guitar? guitar? You bring it. Okay. Let's, you let's, let's break it out, out right now while we're talking about because I got to see this. Thing. It's insane. This is, this is it right here. This is it. You ready? And then we'll go into the game right after that. But this is it. Dude, I'm super excited. I haven't learned any technique. We got, I'm going to read some of this. Thing. All right. Let's we're, see if I can play. We're about, as long as it sounds good, you can fret it. Exactly. Bear clawing. Oh, is, it, is that what it is? Bear clawing. Bear clawing. Is that what it's called? Um, so like, uh, let me think of something. I'm gonna, you keep playing, I'm gonna make sure we got it on there. Okay, my gosh, this thing. Oh my gosh! I've never seen anything like that before. That's insane. Isn't that weird? That's a big. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. It takes a minute. Yeah, yeah. Check it out. You gotta get I've never heard of But it's like something that. else to play. That's what Kate says is bear call. Bear call. I've never heard yeah, of that. I mean, that is so cool. Isn't that wild? That is I don't insane. know. I learned it and I'm like, now I'm determined to put that yes. somewhere. Yes. <laughs> I love it so much now I got in front of it. It's so cool. Oh my gosh. Who taught you that? Did you just already speak um, Well, so the, for my sanity, because I, I, at ASU, I do graphic design, right? Yes. Um, but I've taken, uh, I need an elective, so uh -huh. I've taken rock guitar over there. Oh, and, no, oh no. my God. The stuff that we talk about, Mr. Scott Baumberg took the same class. And it, the, the professor's wild, but he's really cool. Yeah, yeah. And he, he taught us that technique. Bear clawing. Bear I've clawing. never, the, if, you just, if you just join us, that is a new thing right here. Yeah. Well, it's it's not what? A new thing. Well, it's, it's not a new thing. <laughs> I've never seen somebody do that with their, their, their thumb, their thumb it, on the other and side. It just opens up. Bring it back up. It really stuff. does. It really does. That's so cool. Yeah, it's wild stuff. I love it. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna move over to the game. We're okay. gonna get the guitar on just a second again. Okay. So, uh, we got a game today. Is real or fake? It's not a great. It's not. A, it's not a great. Real or okay. fake? <laughs> I haven't. I haven't practiced this. Uh, okay. I haven't gone over it. So, if you're on YouTube, uh, watching this. You're gonna be able to see. I'm gonna put this up for you guys, and we're gonna try. I'm gonna I'm gonna turn around for for everybody on on Instagram. We'll make it that like that. 
So it's fig photo with an F. With an F. With an F. Oh, it's gonna be hard to see this. It's that good. Ah, it's totally ah. that good. There you go. There we go. There we, we go. Got, we know we gotta be there. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna start it off. So before we pick it, is this computer graphics? Or is this a photo? I'm gonna show it to her first. That's a, gonna... That's, That's a photo. That's a photo, okay. yeah. I'm gonna show you guys. You see it? It's like a lighter. You got it? You got it? Okay. Let's see. On on YouTube, we'll just put the video up. Like yes. That. In fact, let me do this right here. We're just gonna... Screen cap? Screen cap it. Wow. I can fix this later too. Fancy schmancy. Fancy schmancy. Oh, we're so fancy <laughs> schmancy here. I should have just said that. <laughs> I wonder if I like do the record the entire. Should I just do a pic? I'll just do a picture. I just do the picture. Just do a picture. Okay. So we said photo. Yeah. Here we go. That's a photo. It doesn't say immediately. <laughs> oh, maybe it was right. I don't know. We'll figure. Okay. Let's see. Oh, maybe photo right. or or computer graphic. You got that's a photo. It's a crab man. It's a crab. Cause he's the crab man. <laughs> photo or computer yeah, graphic. Yeah. Let's see. Kind of hard to see, honestly. We're gonna get back. We're gonna go back to this. Bam. That's gotta be a photo. Which one? But the thing is. Should we say photo? Okay. Photo, computer, graphic. That's a photo. All of them are They're photos. They're all photos. <laughs> I guess technically all of them are photos. Photos, but with an F. F. There we go. Photo, computer, graphic. Here, we're looking at this one. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Photo or. <laughs> okay, so we're saying photo as well. Okay, it hasn't shown up, so either we're right 100% of the time or not. So let's see. I almost want to think that's it's a. a computer? If I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I've never seen that photo. It kind of looks like computer graphic with the shadow. Yeah, that's chin. wild. I would say that. I would say computer. Okay. It looks like Clint Eastwood. Photoshopped, yeah. Wood rings, yes. It's a nice looking pic. Look at that. For sure. It looks like some contrast. Some I'm going to say computer graphic on same, that one. Same, same. Switch it up. I haven't seen that's anything computer. That. That's computer. computer. That's, that's computer. That's computer. Oh, look at that. We knew immediately. You got the eye. I got, you know, watch me. You didn't know, you like, man, I thought I wasn't doing school today, but you are, are doing school. Are doing school today. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Graph. They look like happy faces. Okay, that looks like a photo to me, maybe. Well, <sighs> God, don't let me, don't let me. I think it's computer. Okay. I'm going to say computer. What, do you, what makes you think that it's computer? I think it's computer because of the way, like, some of these land things are. They oh, look, yeah. like, not quite. They do. A little kind of bit. Kind blended in. Filter or photo? It's computer graphics or photo? Is it was it an actual photo? Or is it like Photoshop? Or, did they, or was it Photoshop and did they, or did they make it up? Is that what that is? Photoshop, Photoshop. I mean, yeah, kind of making a there we go. computer graphics. What even is? There's a long. That's nice. Ooh, that's pervy. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'll I'll say that's a photo. That's a photo. It's a pretty photo. I don't know. Part of me wants to say it's computer generated. Whatever, but wow. you thought you're watching an MGM movie right now. A what? <laughs> oh, wow. oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You said photo? Yeah. Photo. Simba. Ooh. Remember who you are. Wow, that's pretty that's good. That's pretty good. <laughs> you should have like James Earl Jones, I'm coming for you, Jack. <laughs> I'm gonna say God. Uh uh, that's a photo. That's a photo. Yeah. That's a photo. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. I'm gonna say it's a photo. As because well. I think they're trying to trip you up by saying like, "Oh, you. that's computer," but, it's but we're not. too good. It's we're too smart cool. for that. Yeah, we're we too don't good. fall for your no, stuff. No, not at all. Okay, we got two more. Okay, hmm. That I mean, that one looks kind of look at the shadow. Yeah, yeah. That would be rough to like. That would put be together. insane. I would be. I'd put say together. photo. So we're saying a photo on that one. Watch them all be computer graphics. It's just a lesson. Like, it's like. <laughs> it's just a lesson in. Uh, Humility, I guess. Humility, wow. Last one. Ooh, ooh. Okay, hmm. I was gonna say computer, but I think that's a photo. The, that would be really hard to get the focus right. off of those things, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's just little things. Absolutely. Is there a difference between Photoshopping and, and computer graphics? Has the boomer like, <laughs> okay, well, no, no, that's no. Good, no, that's a good question, actually. I have the same question as No, it? so do I. And I'm the graphic designer. Oh, you're good. <laughs> uh, so let's see. I would almost think that computer graphic... Oh, I'm going to put this up. Sorry. I would almost think that computer graphic would make me think the entire thing is was made... By completely by just computer. like AI? Almost. Ooh. 
Oh, but I don't know, because in Photoshop, I don't know what the... Let's look up the difference. We'll computer. Google it in just a second. You're not a boomer, Ken. You're good, <laughs> bud. Oh, wait, we said uh, photo on that one. Yeah. Submit answers. Bam. Oh, I didn't take a photo of any of those. It's okay. We'll YouTube, we're going to figure it out. Oh. What did we score? So 70%. we're 70%. Percent. But they didn't... Oh, they do show you the answers. Okay. So that one was a photo. So the, uh, yeah, the... That one was computer graphics. What the heck? And so was that one. That's wild. Dang, but we got most of them right. Yeah, that's not bad. Dang. Okay, so I'm going to show you the answers right All here. All right, y'all. This is what a four-year degree will get you. It's <laughs> 70%. <laughs> 70%. <laughs> and a pat on the back. And a pat Look on at the that. Back. So the first one with the flame was actually computer graphic. And the one... With the, the bird was a photo. The bird was a photo, was a photo. and the uh, the but the room. Boom! That's weird. That one that is was insane. Wild. I wonder what I wonder what makes it that way. We take a picture of filters, but such yeah. So that might that might determine what? whether or not it's photoshopped or not. I don't know, yeah. I don't know man. Crazy. It's, it's crazy. Four year degree, it. ASU. Four years. There you go. That's what it gets you. <laughs> yeah. So I just want to be a musician. So you can try it again. Okay. Cool. <laughs> We're gonna write that up. So let's look up what's the difference. Here's the answers, ladies and gentlemen, ladies Between and gentlemen, and everyone. Photoshop. Maybe so I go back. computer. So oh, I'm the, just fixing oh you. Head. <laughs> oh I'm so sorry. <laughs> so see. we often see these images that are such good quality. We don't consider whether the picture is reality or if it was computer generated. So, it's so computer, completely computer, computer generated. generated is CG, and then photoshopped with something wow. that came in and, and changed and, it up. Yeah, yeah. And wow, insane. And then if you can look, remember, uh, if you can remember, I'm such a lazy. <laughs> Us. Going back through it, seeing those photos to see that's insane, like that room. Mm -hmm. I would just never How guess the you, shadows. The shadows was perfect and stuff. That How did they crazy. even? Yeah, I that don't even so know. Crazy. That's crazy. Man, well, thank you for playing. Robots that was fun. Are gonna take over the world. The robots okay. are gonna take over. They the really world. are. We had a few. Yeah, my gosh, it's just crazy. They're coming for my job. Okay, <laughs> they're coming for my job. The <laughs> or oh, like, have you heard about uh, computers just making music? No. They, they, That's a thing? That make is it good though? Job. They know, like, the thing is they know, like, oh, like, this is Chuck. This is, oh, man, I'm having a, a problem. Have, do you have a word, this is a question I normally ask. Do you have a word that you have a hard time saying? I mean, I, I do. I mean, I'm You're all, I'm all over the place oh, all the time. Well, no, but, no. like, that cop off the top of my head. Uh, suspicious is one that I have to really think suspicious? about. Suspicious? Yes. That's well, rough. Unsolicited. Is Unsolicited. That's pretty rough. What's another one? Oh man, if Echo is here, she can tell me. Cinnamon's a hard Cinnamon. one. Cinnamon. And then synonym. Cinnamon. 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 <laughs> Cinnamon. That's a rough one. I love it so much. It's so funny. Man, there's one other word. I can't remember. It's going to come to me and I'm going to cut you off in the middle of it. That's just what a great host that. Don't worry um, about it. What, what was I just saying? Oh, we were talking about the... Uh, computer. We want a computer. Yes, the computer. Uh, Generated music. Chart topping pops. Hits. They can just come in and go. Oh, like it. Uh, the, it goes from this interval to this interval. We're gonna have this, and so maybe you, I don't know if they have somebody singing over the top of it. I can't imagine serious. Uh, 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 all uh, robotic. Yes. Oh man, it just be like. It's so funny, man. I love it. <laughs> okay, um, let's go over uh, the. Let's. This is the time to plug anything that we're working on. Do we have? Are you? Uh, do you have any shows coming up? I have, okay, <laughs> so, give me a sec, we're, we can, we can me and my, my band, Dragons in the Desert, Shady. at Dragons in the Desert Band, on, we'll plug them in the link below, in the link there, right, below, yes, not for you guys, not but for, for these guys, those. Dragons in the Desert, what's the Instagram, uh, at Dragons in the Desert Band, uh, we're playing, we're opening for Ad Advance at Club Red, yes. on March 20, or March 21st, 21st, it's a Saturday, it's it's going to be fun. Yes. We're going to light things on fire. That's not oh. true, but you won't know unless you come. There you so go. There you go. Well, are they going to light things on we fire? We might. You never know. We're dragons in the yeah. desert. We <laughs> have to do something with fire. Uh, you have to buy but. tickets and there's a pre-sale. Uh, yes. Okay. Yes. And I, with dragons, if you just go give us a little follow, we'll keep y'all updated with that right away. And it, it'll be good. It'll be good. I love it. Mm -hmm. Echo's on the show right now. Hey, Echo. Let's go to let's go to the show the twenty first at uh, Club Red. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'll be there. You'll be there. I'll be there. Well, oh I gotta got double check, but yeah. I'll be. <laughs> and Kenny, you gotta come with me, man. It'll be fun. You, you guys, you're gonna love 
these guys. You, uh, the whole band is amazing. Oh, uh, thank you. The uh, the guitarist always sticks out to me. That kid, Casey. Is, Casey. Oh, and, no. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. I love that him. That kid, he just shred. Yeah, he shreds. He's so he good. Shreds. He's, he's, he's a got tall the guy. Hair. He's got the hair. You know what Stringer. he reminds me of? What's that? Do you, have y'all ever seen Barnyard? You know the little thing. I think I've seen Barnyard. <laughs> the little yeah. thing that like, my man be tight, my Joe. Break dances. <laughs> Put that, you throw that on YouTube. Oh my too. gosh, I'll put that Sometimes one on YouTube. Cotton Eye Joe mm -hmm. uh, from Barnard. Gotcha. Yes. Love it. Yes, yes you Kenny, can tag you're tagging along. along Hell man. yeah, you you're can. Coming you're coming up. Hi. Um, Echo, what's the. I know this is such a. This is great. This is just so professional. What's the word that I have a hard time <laughs> saying? Uh, what's the word that I have a hard time saying? Wow. We were just talking about this the other day. Just leave it down. What's the word that I have a hard time saying? Wow. We were just talking about this the other day. Just leave it down. I will find it. Okay, sorry. <laughs> so we're talking about dragons and. Yes, dragons. dragons. So yes. that's the, the new like, upcoming show that we have coming. Um, as far as other stuff, do you have anything coming up personally? Personally, I do not. Oh, there it is. Do I? No, mom, <laughs> mom, do oh, I have anything? Hey, oh, no, yeah, Aaron. Aaron remembers the barnyard guy. We'll post it. We'll post no. it. All right, here's the word that I can't say cumulative. I can't say it. I'm not even sure. Cum cum <laughs> cumulative, <laughs> cumulative, cumulative. I can't do it. And I just got a response from mom. I no, no, I don't have anything coming she up. But Gail, 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 everyone give it up. Gail, Gail yes, love, love you. Love you. She love is you. you guys such an amazing family. Oh, I, well, I thank really mean you. that. Every Aww. time I see them, they're so nice. They come up. And it's just really nice to have somebody like come up. They, they look you in the eye and they, and they you, you genuinely feel, genuinely, it's another word, that feel like a lot of love from them. You feel they're a lot of cumulative great, love from Cumulative them. love. I almost did it that time. I was almost there. There we go. <laughs> I love it so much. That's great. Are you uh, are you recording anything? Um, no, not right now. Okay. Just be, but I really want to. Yeah, school. When does, uh, school is the death of everything creative, and I hope both you and mom, dad and mom, hear that. <laughs> no, I'm just Glass kidding. Glass Eye just, I'm just they kidding. have a lot of really cool stuff. You got to check out. Guys. Glass Eye. Yes. Okay. They do some a lot of cool. Do they all have photos glass eyes? and yes. Yeah, well, I don't know. Who's to say? That's it. pretty cool. I, I I'm trying to remember. Do you guys can correct me if I'm wrong? But I think we met at, at Raw. Phoenix. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. Oh, Ra? Yes, but I, I've been following them for a little while, and uh, they every time that one of the, the things comes up, is they got it's such really a good. Cool. They just do these really cool photos, um, and I need to I need to ask them if what's you know well, computer graphic <laughs> Photoshop. Who knows? <laughs> we were just talking about that stuff. Um, yeah, incredible yeah. stuff. You guys are, are so good. So okay, not recording anything right now. Do you have? Have you been working on some new stuff though? So the, I will say this. So. Uh, me and my buddies, uh, Janae Dunn, Lois Zabrato, and Sammy Martinez just came up with a song. Yes. Uh, it's called Build Us, and it's under the name Quadrivial. Quadrivial. Um, that's our little, like, makeshift band. Dig it. And I'll just say that we came out with it, but there's still some ball roll in there. Okay. And there's still some a little surprises, a little couple no of other things we have slept I love it. Today. I can't so wait. I if can't you kind of keep an eye out, then, yes. then, then we'll yes. have Oh, yes. There was something. I remember we did we did something together, and I actually threw something at you. <laughs> and I felt really bad about throwing that. Oh, yes. You did throw me. Throw something at I me. Did. You'll just have to find out see what. I got to try out my drumming trial. Yes. Oh, oh. I'm getting no more. I can't, I can't try to, I'm getting to not say anything else. Um, okay. Well, you know what? I think that's. Is there anything else you want to plug? Let me do that before I say. <laughs> like, and we're done. Like, and we're done. Wait, 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 Oh, is there anything else we want to plug? Um, just you know, let's plug out uh, this guy right here, good old Dean Nelson. No, you stop yes, it. You're yes. only watching. It. Yeah. Get out of town. How do we, how do people follow you? How do they follow me? Yes. If they just look up Sierra Cisneros. I think on her Instagram, it's Sierra Cisneros Official. And Cisneros. Cisneros. C okay, ah, Sierra. Cisneros. Sierra is like the pop star. C-I-A-R-A. -A. Like, gotcha. you know, the uh, pop. Um, and then Cisneros is C-I-S-N-E-R-O-S. -S. So that's it. if you just look up that, then I should be around there. Somewhere. There we go. Yeah, yeah. And then Dragons in the Desert, too. If y'all haven't. Well, we do some fun hard rock stuff. These guys, we're sure, fun. These we, guys are so good. We're excited. So, so if y'all wanted to give us a follow there, that would be great. Great, do yeah. it, you guys. You need to do it. These guys are cranking up Aww. great stuff. <laughs> All right, okay. I want to say thank you so much for being on the show. I'm so I'm I'm I'm. You are just one of the most multi talented people, Aww, and just one of the nicest you. people Aww. you could ever meet. And I mean, I really mean yeah. that. And this has been such a fun episode for me. It's just it's very fun. easy. And everything, and everybody that's been on the show has been been been, 
been easy this and good, but this has been Have you ever a, a thought good. it's because you're a homie? Have you ever thought I don't know about that? any of that. I don't know. You're kind of the constant. This is my that. home. And Those are it. his curtains. Those are my curtains. Let's see. And his oh, it's so bright outside. You thought it was dark. It's still dark if it's 2 a.m. Okay. I just want to say thank you so much for being on the show. Love you very much. Well, this is just an well, amazing talent and just an amazing person. You really got to check her out. Um, and uh, we're just all, I'm so happy that you're part of this community. You make the community better. Aw, well, you thank you, dude. I mean, <laughs> you, she's done so many great things for me. I didn't even, we, I, I got so lost in what we were talking about. You've done such a great, with graphic design, you were just incredible. Aww. That the, uh, the, the press room poster, you did that one. Oh, and you're just so easy to work with. And if you guys are looking for something, I don't know if I can plug it. Uh, go ahead, go ahead. Plug, you need to talk to, to, to Sierra, she's incredible. And uh, we, you also did the new music there, Flossily! I did, Logo. I did do that. It's insane. That. They're so good and you gave me so many well, thank you. Oh, I love them. And those are all available on the uh, the website. They are, yes. Yeah, and that will be plugged as well below. Bam. So if you're looking for something, there, there we go. 